Hey guys, it's Hannah. Um, I'm using my HD camera right now. Um, I'm going to do another Gemma Kid inspired look. Um, you know, I did a review on this book, I think. I don't know if I have. If you want a review on this book, let me know though. Um, so this is the, um, the look I did last time was the olive one. It was the olive look. And it looked, it was like, it looked like this. And that was like a nude kind of like you don't make it look like you don't have any makeup. So this is the fair tone. And then next week I'll do um, porcelain. So everything that I'm going to get is out of this book. And I'm going to actually read the instructions this time. Like you know. So let's get started. First you're going to want to tidy the brows to make sure that they look all good. And so then you're going to use, oh, I'm also using, I'll tell you the stuff that I used later on. But you're going to use a light um, shimmery um, beige eyeshadow powder. And you're going to put that over the entire lid. So I'm just going to get a fluffy brush in this beige color. You want it to lightly shimmer. You don't want it to be like ultra shimmery. So you're going to put this all over the entire lid. So nice clean wash. Okay. So then after that, what you want to do is um, give the eyes, blend a soft matte brown. Um, um, I'm going to use this brown right here, if you can see. And I'm going to use a um, crease brush. I'm going to get that. And it says to use it into the um, crease in the outer corner. So like last time, outer corner is like right here and then the crease. So I'm just going to put that on the outer crease. Okay. So then what I want to do is I'm going to take that fluffy brush again. Ooh, that's got a lot of stuff on it. Okay. Is to um blend it out. Like, it's clean and all that. So I'm just going to blend that eye crease color out. Because sometimes you can get it way too hot. So then what you're going to do is you're going to highlight... Um, going to highlight your brow bone so what I'm going to do oh wait hold up did I get another shadow no I don't so I'm just going to take this um peachy apricot color and just kind of and just uh put it on the brow bone and here we go then you're going to put on mascara I already did that I already put on mascara and did my brows so then what you're going to do is um you know apply your foundation concealer powder all that and you're going to want a um, soft, um, fresh pink and pinky beige powder blush and mix them together and put them together. Well, I just have this Lancome blush, subtle, subtle, um, and I don't, I can't read the name. It's French, so I can't read it. I'm just going to take my Elf um, blushing professional bronzing brush and I'm just going to take it. And apply it to the um, apples of my cheeks and to my cheekbones. So, smile, put it on your cheekbones right here, and then bring it back. So it's like all not, so you don't look like a clown, because like you know how clowns have like those red cheeks and stuff. So what you want to do is you want to get you know your powder onto your brush, whatever blush you want. Just as long as it's like a light pink. This powder, I mean this stuff is powdery and you're gonna smile put it on the apples of the cheeks and then you're gonna blend it towards your cheekbone with your cheekbones right here you can do the cheeky face fishy face and see um, where your cheekbones are at and this blush gives you like a nice highlighting too it's very pretty so I'm just gonna you know make sure that that's all well blended in and then um, for the lips very simple um, pink shell gloss but this is like more of a very opaque color so I'm just gonna use a little bit okay so I know my lip is like chap right there so the um, eyeshadow quad I just use the entire quad is butternut by elf it's their dollar line and um the lip gloss that I used is pink, 
Pink Pearl by LA Colors. It's their moisturizing lip gloss. And um, the blush that I used, of course, I said it was a Lancome blush. Um, I can't read that, but if you can tell, it's like the name's right there. And so, yeah, so check this look out if you um, want like a neutral kind of look. Like you don't want to want to look like you have a whole bunch of makeup on, but then again, you don't want to look like you don't like you know. You want to have a nice medium. You can put this look on. And um, next week I will do. Um, I'm not going in order, but um, I'm going to be doing deep set skin, and then I'm yeah. So I'm going to do another video after this because I feel like I haven't been doing enough videos. So yeah, stay tuned for that. Alright, see you guys. Bye.